welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome to my channel Chessie here aka Miss Chicky Holly so guys if you are new hello to everyone who returning subscriber ka so alam nyo naman guys na sobrang mahilig ako sa multi-purpose products and I am very excited pag nakaka-discover ako ng mga multi-purpose products kasi guys I'm a lazy girl especially on a daily basis gusto ko isang product lang yung nilalagay ko sa face ko mainly sa cheeks and sa lips and multi-purpose. So today, I am going to review the Careline Multi-Pots. If you want to know my thoughts on the Careline Multi-Pots, you know the drill, guys! Please keep on watching! Okay, guys, so before we start the review, I just want to let you know na currently, if you're watching this right now na in-upload ko, I'll be in Korea. So I'll be in Korea for the weekend. Mabilis lang naman yung trip ko, pero dahil doon, I'm so sorry, medyo na-delay na naman yung mga reviews natin. But don't worry guys, it's coming. It's coming talaga. Ang dami-dami kong reviews in store for you guys. And of course, magkakaroon tayo ng Korean haul and vlog. So back to our current review. The Caroline Multipod. So ito yung packaging niya. It's very simple. It's color white. Na nakasulat lang dyan. Caroline Multipod. And then at the back, andito na yung manufacturing date cruelty free, paraben free and 24 months when you open it. I really like it na nakalagay na dito especially yung manufacturing date. So nakasunod dito May 2019. So in 24 months, 2 years from now, saka pa lang siya mag-expire. So at least alam mo. And also this product has 2.2 grams and retails for 165 pesos only. Oh my god, guys, sobrang affordable. So Currently, ang favorite cream blush ko, well, kung alam nyo at nanonood kayo, it's the Sunny Space Air Blushes. Pero guys, ang mahal nun. And that has 2.5 grams of product and this has 2.2. But the price is, this is way cheaper. So if you want me to compare them both, so today mag-focus lang tayo dito kay Caroline. Pero kung gusto nyo i-compare, just comment it down below para magkaroon tayo ng face off. This is how it looks like. It's very simple. Wala naman siyang mirror. And this is the product. So we have three shades from the multi-pot. Let's first start with Abracadabra. So si Abracadabra, ito yung parang may pagka-pink siya na pwede siyang maging bright pink pero pwede rin muted pink. Ang maganda kasi sa mga cream blushes, yung intensity pwede mo siyang i-build up. So, pwedeng konti-konti lang or madami. Pang ilagay sa cheeks mo or sa lips mo. Yung consistency niya, while I'm doing this, creamy yung consistency niya na may pagka-dewy pero pag nilagay mo siya sa skin mo, nagiging matte siya. So, if I compare to the Blythe Cosmetics, kasi yun yung medyo similar siguro sa kanila and for same brand, mas dewy si Blythe. So, ito, ayan o, if you can see. Tsaka, grabe yung pagka-pigmented niya, guys. Ayan. Pero, kita nyo, when you spread the product, nagla-lighten siya. So, especially when you blend it. Pink siya, pero hindi siya super bright na pink. Next, we have Magic Spell. Hindi ko na siya mabuksan. So, si Magic Spell, may pagka-peachy yung shade niya eh. Peachy na may konting hint of brown. Ayan no? Ganda. Actually, ang ganda ng shade na to. Bibuild up ko lang guys ha, para mas makita nyo. And then last but not the least is what I'm wearing on my whole face. It's my favorite shade, Head Over Heels. So ito, nagamit ko na to guys. Alam ko na yung performance nitong product na to. But the two shades before Head Over Heels, ngayon ko lang siya na matatry. So again, these are the shades. We have Abracadabra, Magic Spell, and Head Over Heels. So now na nakita nyo na yung swatches sa arm ko, before I move on sa swatches on my eyes, cheeks, and lips, yes guys, sa eyes. Nag-try tayo ngayon sa eyes kasi usually when I review products, I don't put sa eyes ko. Usually cheeks and lips lang. Pero since I'm very excited for this multi-purpose product, I really want to go all in for you guys. So more about the Caroline Multipod. As what I said earlier, yung head over heels, na-try ko na siya. So alam ko na yung thoughts ko about this. First application, especially sa cheeks, it is buildable. So, depende rin 
sa pagkuha mo ng product using your fingers, I usually just use my fingers to apply this. I never use a brush or a sponge, but you can. Pero bakit pa? Kasi may fingers naman, di ba? Free pa. It is pigmented, pero yung pagka-pigmented niya, ang maganda, hindi siya over-pigmented. Kasi for me, guys, pag mga blush, mas okay na yung buildable kaysa yung super pigmented na parang sinampal na yung cheeks mo. So, dito, konti-konti lang and then pwede mo i-build or kahit actually na marami kang ilagay. Sobrang blendable niya na nagsusubside yung color at nasispread out siya sa cheeks nyo. So, I super love it na ganun yung case dito sa blush na to. Now, for the lips naman, pwede mo naman siya i-apply na you, you do this and then apply it. Pero what I do, I do the dabbing motion. Kasi mas nagkakaroon ng pigment. Eh, sorry lang. Pahis pag dinadab niya lang siya. So, ang maganda dito, pag dinagay niya siya sa lips, para kang nagkakaroon ng blurred out lip, lip effect if you do the dabbing motion. Of course, if you do yung normal way, para lang siyang light lipstick. Ganun yung feeling niya sa lips. Actually, ngayon, wala nga akong maramdaman na may lipstick ako. Para siyang very light lang na lip. Hindi siya balm eh. Kasi even though yung consistency niya dito, parang ang dewy niya, once na nasa lips mo na siya or nasa cheeks na nagmamatify nga siya. So for the longevity of this product, I've tried this na and nakita ko na hindi siya ganun ka long wearing. Of course, sa lips, maintindihan mo naman. Siyempre, when you eat, mawawala talaga. Hindi naman to liquid lipstick or any meat. Pero sobrang dali lang mag-reapply. Pero guys, kung dry yung lips nyo, like I have dry lips, chapped, dry, flaky, lahat na, mas magandang mag-lip balm ka muna or mag-exfoliate ka muna bago mo to apply Kasi it can be a little drying and of course, it will emphasize yung mga pagbabalat sa lips. Pero pag exfoliate ka naman to moisturize, hindi naman siya ganun kahalata. Like na, now, kasi okay yung lips ko. At last, though, hindi niya na-emphasize ngayon yung pagka-dry ng lips ko. Kasi I always use lip balm every night. Now, for the cheeks, yung longevity niya, it lasted me for about 4 hours. Pero guys, I wasn't sweating. I was just sitting down sa office. So, hindi siya ganun ka lang lasting. I believe na if you sweat, mawawala na talaga to. Now, for the eyes naman, if you have a little bit of an oily lid, kasi yung akin, even though dry yung skin ko, sa eyes ko, minsan parang napapansin ko when I apply it, medyo dewy yung itsura niya eh. Hindi ka tulad dito sa cheeks or sa lips na, na, na matte siya. So, ang mas maganda, it will also help the longevity of the product if you put a translucent powder on your cheeks and also sa eye area. So, yun ang tip ko sa inyo, especially for oily girls and boys there. Ngayon, kung dry naman yung skin nyo at gusto nyo pa rin na mas tumagal yung product, okay doon na mag-powder. Pero use a translucent powder. Kasi if you use a normal powder, mawawala yung color niya sa cheeks nyo. And of course, sa eyes. So before I tell you my final thoughts, let's first move on to the swatches. Wow.
guys, so now for my final verdict, I think you have an idea na. So for the Caroline Multi Pot, I super love this product. Sobrang ganda nitong product and it is very very affordable. 165 pesos kahit na 2.2 grams lang. I know guys, konti lang 'yon. Pero pag naubos niyo to, ang dali-dali lang bumili ulit. So definitely the price, yes. Okay na okay yung price. Now the formula. I super love the formula kahit hindi siya ganun ka long wearing. Kasi honestly, even with the Sunny Space Air Blushes, hindi rin naman ganun ka long wearing yun. Pero ito guys, affordable na and medyo similar sila. Not na formula, pero pareho silang multi-purpose cream for the eyes, cheeks, and lips. So, yun yung similarities nila. So, if you want me to do a comparison video like a face-off with the Sunny Space and the Caroline Multi Pot, just comment it down below. For for the shade selection, so sayang lang kasi 3 shades la. I hope Caroline would release more shades kasi super ganda ng formula niya. Kahit hindi siya long lasting, ang ganda niya sa skin. Guys, when I apply this kasi I never put a powder. Siguro sa lids ko lang, maybe I would kasi as what I said earlier, medyo nag-oil up yung lids ko. Pero sa cheeks, Ang ganda ng lapat niya sa skin, kita nyo. Yun talaga yung gusto ko sa mga cream products eh. Dahil sobrang natural lang yung itsura niya sa face mo. So basically, I would highly, highly recommend this. Especially kung mahilig kayo sa mga cream products and multi-purpose products in general. So for the shades na recommend ko, I actually love everything naman. Pero siguro top ko would be... Head Over Heels, this one, and the Magic Spell. Yung Abra Kadabra kasi pink, hindi ako masyado na wow dun sa color niya. So that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Give it a big thumbs up if you like it. And if you are not yet subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel para naman maging part kayo ng ating Cheeky Fam Squad. So guys, if I reach 500 subscribers, magpapag-giveaway ako. So watch out for that. I hope guys na nag-enjoy kayo at may natutunan kayo sa video na to. So if you are looking for a cream blush or a multi-purpose cream na napaka-affordable, Ayan na, Caroline, Multipot is the way to go. Guys, if meron kayong mga alam na ibang multi-purpose products and na gusto nyo i-review ko, just comment it down below. And of course, all details of this product and other videos to watch can be found in the description box down below. So yun lang guys, I'll see you again next time.